Any questions over here? Fight fair, fight hard. Touch them up. I feel the stand corrected. It's not so much the height as it, it is the leg length. Yeah, Nicole, she's got longer arms and legs. Good right hand there. Good, very good right hand. Good kick leading it off. And you can see the experience here of Tiffany Cass. She's taking yep. her time. You know, Nicole came out nice and hard. Hit her a couple good shots, but Tiffany's taking her time. Trying to figure it out. Good knee there. Solid knee. Nicole is working really well off her footwork. Yeah, she's moving, she's moving around a lot, and Tiffany's taking her time, waiting for those attacks. Really getting in the clinch. She's getting the better of Nicole in the clinch. Nicole's also coming in with her chin a little bit up. That could be precarious. And this is full rule, so there are elbows. There are elbows. Nicole needs to let those hands go. She's, she's almost every time she throws that right hand, she's hitting her with it. Mm -hmm. Tiffany, she's doing a better job in the clinch. If I was Tiffany, I would be telling her to be in the clinch. If I was Tiffany's corner, I'd be yep. telling her to stay, stay in, in the, the clinch. clinch. She's working in the clinch really well. She's winning the fight in the clinch. And Nicole's corner needs to tell her to stay on the outside. Again, if Nicole can stay on that outside, I think she can win this whole fight. Um, Tiffany, again, she needs to get in that clinch. That's where she was doing the most work in the first round. Mm. Nice front tip. Oh! Beautiful. Two teeps to the face in a row. And that's that outside what I was talking about. Yep, but then she ends up on the inside. And doesn't do much and with does, it. Yeah, it's not good She's hit, getting hit with the knees in the inside. She needs to stay where her weapons are most effective. Using that long length. And that's something that sometimes is hard for fighters with long arms, tall people. You know, they, they need to learn how long they are. But once you learn how long you are, you use it to your advantage really well. And Tiffany hit a couple of nice knees in a clinch. Tiffany needs to get to work in the clinch there. There you go, good knee. Great prevented from being yep. dumped there. Nice hop really with a turn up. to the knee. Textbook. But staying in there, working those knees. Right into the knees, though, right in that clinch. Yep. But Tiffany seems to be taking advantage and grabbing that tip and pulling her in because she knows she's got her advantage on the inside. So, yeah. Tiffany's got a little bit of a. A little bit of a mouse coming up there on the uh, right up. eye. Let's see what happens. Let's see if her corner was telling her that. Yeah, high risk, yeah move. high risk move didn't quite work out for you. Oh. And Nicole knows this is a third round, and she knows that she's getting beaten the clinch, so she's trying to come out hard and keep it. She's looking for that hard shot every time. Wagner splits him up. Amazing balance from her. 
Tiffany's just dropping leather on her. Good there's knees. There's that clinch again. Nicole either needs to figure out what to do or needs to get the hell out of there. Yeah, Nicole definitely needs to stay on the outside. Um, she's winning the fight on the outside. That's where she needs to be. Getting creative with the elbows in that last break. Right, Tiffany doing a good job with those knees. Knees, hitting a couple elbows. Good job on those really straight knees from Tiffany. In there, making doing, the work matter. Yep, doing enough work to keep the clinch active, not taking breaks, getting some damage. And you can see from our, our view that Nicole's not a big fan of getting hit with those knees. Good elbow work off of that. Great I think round. I think Tiffany did, she did a great Bad job. decision, however, I must make a note here that it's across the board 29-28. 29-28, 29-28. Very, very close. In favor of Smithtown's own Nicole Jimmy Jim Baby. 